we'll see the eighth question the question is a cement company earns a profit of rupees 8 per bag of white cement sold and a loss of rupees 5 per bag of grey cement sold in that the first bit is the company sells 3000 bags of white cement and 5000 bags of grey cement in a month what is its profit or loss we'll see the solution we'll write the profit of rupees 8 per bag of white cement sold for every bag of white cement sold the company earns a profit of rupees 8 since it's a profit we represent it with positive symbol now for every bag of grey cement sold the company earns a loss of rupees 5 since it is loss we represent it with negative symbol now in the first bit the company sells 3000 bags of white cement therefore the profit earned by company by selling 3000 bags of white cement is equals to 3000 times rupees 8 3000 multiplied with 8 gives 3 times 8 gives 24 and we are left with 3 zeros that is equals to 24000 therefore the profit earned by company by selling 3000 bags of white cement is plus rupees 24000 the company also sells 5000 bags of grey cement therefore the loss of the company by selling 5000 bags of grey cement in a month is equals to 5000 multiplied by rupees 5 but since it is loss we give negative sign 5 times 5 gives 25 and we are left with three zeros when we multiply two integers having dissimilar signs we always get a negative sign in the answer therefore 5000 multiplied by negative 5 gives negative sign that is equals to negative rupees 25000 therefore the loss of the company is equals to minus rupees 25000 now the total profit or loss of the company is equals to the profit gained by the company by selling 3000 bags of white cement which is rupees 24000 and uh, it is added with the loss of the company by selling 5000 bags of grey cement which is minus rupees 25000 that gives minus rupees 1000 therefore the total profit or loss is equals to minus rupees 1000 since it is bearing a negative sign it is loss therefore the total loss of the company is equals to rupees 1000 we'll see the second problem the question is what is the number of white cement bags it must sell to have neither profit nor loss if the number of grey bags sold is 6400 bags in the question it says we should get neither profit nor loss which implies the profit of the company must be equal to the loss of the company now if the number of grey bags sold is 6400 bags the loss incurred by the company is equals to 6400 into rupees 5 per bag of grey cement sold is the loss therefore 6400 multiplied by rupees 5 gives the total loss incurred by the company that is equals to 32000 this must be equal to the total profit gained by the company therefore the total profit gained by the company can be written as the number of white cement bags sold multiplied with the profit on one white cement bag 
that is given in the question as rupees 8 since the profit is equals to loss we get 32000 is equals to number of white cement bags sold multiplied with the profit on one white cement bag that is given as rupees 8 therefore rearranging the terms we get number of white cement bags sold is equal to taking 8 to the left hand side we get 32,000 divided by 8 that gives 8 cancels 32 4 times and we are left with 3 zeros that is equals to 4,000 therefore we have to sell a total of 4,000 white cement bags to get neither profit nor loss.